February's horror block coming at ya. <laughs> Obey the rules of Halloween, and you're good to go. This is hey, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Hello Horror, and another unboxing and today we are going to be unboxing horror blocks February block and I am forever fashionably late with my horror blocks I don't know why I can't seem to get it together man <laughs> but fortunately I haven't even seen any leaks or anything so I really uh, this will be a surprise which is <laughs> what it's supposed to be right so uh, let's do this, fiends. Got my uh, good old box opening tool, and this particular uh, horror block is wrapped up in shrink wrap or saran wrap, whatever you want to call it. So uh, I'm actually slicing through this plastic instead of its normal tape, in case you were wondering, because <laughs> you looked like you were concerned. Anyways, okay, so here we go. Let's just open this right up. Ah, February. Um, really quick, in a nutshell, as always, per the usual, Horror Block is a monthly subscription. Uh, this block you get on your doorstep once a month and it is filled with horror items. Uh, all kinds actually, you know, you can get like cups and t-shirts and pencil holders and uh, You know tons of stuff all catered to your favorite franchise. So that's fun, right? It's in the box? What's in the fucking box? So let's get into this. I'm already staring at the shirt that is always right on top so uh, Damn it. We always forget the sneak peeks I actually, because again, uh, the thing that I had noticed that was different about these now is um, it doesn't come so much with a what to look forward to into the next month. And I didn't get a chance to go onto their Facebook or website to see what this box entails. So actually there's nothing for us to reference because I didn't check. So sorry about that. <laughs> So this will be just a big old fat surprise. Ooh, I love it. It's a purge shirt. So good. This is awesome. Statue of Liberty and obviously the, the city and their little masks that they wear. Loving that green, that teal, whatever. That is so pretty. You can match it with some gnarly eyeshadow. So good. So item number one, a purge shirt. I really like this. this. Okay, and item number two is, uh, oh my gosh, how cute. I'm pretty sure that this is the Amityville house in a pin. Oh my gosh, I absolutely love it. It says Wax Off Designs Custom Collectible from Wax Off Designs. A horror, blo <laughs> horror block exclusive. Um, like I said, I think this is the, the Amityville house in a pin. I could just die. That is so cute. Again, I'm, I'm my, my pin game is pretty strong. I'm just going to throw that out there. So item number two. All right, and we are moving on to our next item, and it is, ooh, a movie. We have a DVD here, and it is Silent Retreat. The rules are simple. Uh, beautifully blends supernatural horror with the terrors of the real world. That's a quote from Rue Morgue. Um, I have not seen this movie however the cover looks amazing almost like a slasher which are my jam it's a 2014 movie as you guys know I'm all about the year uh this looks super good so yay and i'm all about always forever adding movies to my collection so yay i'm pretty stoked on this silent retreat 
Moving on to our next item. <laughs> Did you like that? <laughs> Woo, Penny Dreadful. That's what the box is. Oh my God. This is so good. Please tell me this is a keychain. Yes, it is. God, this is good. Okay, so uh, came in a little Penny Dreadful slide box here and um, <laughs> this is so cool. It's a keychain with a uh, scorpion inside it's like a teardrop um and it is a real scorpion in there that is absolutely fantastic holy cow i love it and a little hang tag that says uh little scorpion and penny dreadful uh i love it i will definitely be putting this on my keys All right, and our next item is, ooh, a book of some sort. Let's see, uh, Vault of the Macabre, Dare You Enter. This is so cute, this little, oh, it's not even a book. It looks like they're poems or haikus or something. His taste for the poetry of the freakish is a joy. That's a quote from Clive Barker. Okay, so how cute. This is like a little book of uh, horror poems. I love it by uh, Darren Field. That is so cool. I will definitely, definitely read these. And actually there's some little bits and pieces of artwork in here too, which seem kind of cute. I love it. Item number, what are we on for? <laughs> yeah. All right, moving on. We have, ooh, what is this? Is this a recyclable bag? What is this? It says Nerd Block Exclusive. I think this is just holding it together. Ah, it says the Amityville Horror. Oh my gosh, how cute. It's just like a recyclable bag. I'm gonna look so fly going to the grocery store with this thing. Are you kidding me? That is what it is. It is a Amityville Horror, the house that matches the pin. And yeah, it's like a recyclable bag. And uh, over here in good old Los Angeles, you do have to bring your own bags to the grocery store because they charge you 10 cents a bag. So this, my fiends, will come in handy like it is nobody's business. <laughs> I absolutely love this. If I could just get like 10 more of these, this would be even better. <laughs> I love it though, this is great. All right, moving on. What else do we have in here? Ooh, here is our little uh, nerd block magazine, our little horror edition. And we have, as always, the ever so wonderful Rue Morgue magazine um, with another awesome cover. It says, She Craves Me Raw, the French coming of age cannibal movie. Um, John Lang, an untold horror, get out. I still don't need to see that movie really bad. So, yay, always love me some Rue Morgue per the huge. And we always get our little uh, $10, $10 credit shirt punch cards. Those are cool. All right, so should we do a quick little recap on our February's horror block? Using our Nerd Block magazine, kind of cool when you open up the book. It is uh, the Amityville house, all bam, right there. So yeah, really quick, um, ooh, this is cool. The history of the Amityville Horror House. That's cool, it says then versus now. I will have to read that a little later. Um, and then again, really quick, um, we have the Amityville Horror Tote Bag, which I'm gonna use the shit out of that. And then we have the Vault of the Macabre, the book of poems, the collection of poems. Um, Silent Retreat DVD, Penny Dreadful Keychain, Amityville Horror House Pin, Rue Morgue Magazine, and The Purge Shirt. Yeah! 
What a great block, I thought. I actually really enjoyed pretty much every item that came in this month's block. So for me, it felt pretty darn solid. What did you guys think? What was your favorite item and maybe even your least favorite item? I'd have to say that my favorite... What? Are you serious? Look at you. <laughs> I'd have to say that my favorite was probably a toss up between the uh, keychain and either the pin or the reusable bag. Because <laughs> I know I'll definitely use that bag for days. So to me, that was great. Anyways, um, again, I think we're going to have to log on to um, either Horror Blocks Facebook or their website in order to see what next month entails because they don't really put it so much in that little magazine, even though they should. So uh, I will leave a link below my themes in case you want to check out Horror Block and, uh, you know, sign up. We could unbox together. We can make it a thing. Sounds fun. And then, of course, also, if you want to check out for the sneak peeks of next month, I probably should do that myself because I do love to know. So I guess that is it. Thank you guys for taking time out of your busy pant dropping schedule to watch my videos. I really do appreciate it and love you for days for it. So uh, I guess that's it. I will uh, check you guys on the flip side. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, have a frightfully good rest of your week and I will see you guys in a week. Okay, bye. See if you fit. Look at you. What a sweet girl. Look at you. You fit like a glove in there. <gasps> I would just die if I got you in the mail. Oh my goodness. Look at you. What are you doing? <gasps> so basically I'm stuck here until I die because I'm not gonna move her. So until you move, we're not moving, right? It's like that meme of a skeleton. With like a creature on their lap. That's me right now. <laughs> hey guys welcome to another episode another unboxing these don't get old do they but you know what does get old is being super fashionably late 